Governor Bashir wants to keep health care affordable and accessible, releasing the third piece of his budget proposal ahead of a big address on Thursday. Fox 56's Bodie Brooks explains how it could bring more nurses to the state and address Kentuckians' health needs. Governor Bashir wants his budget to care for the Commonwealth. It is an urgent need, which is why my budget fully funds the Medicaid program, including Medicaid expansion. About one in three Kentuckians currently rely on the program. A nationwide shortage of nurses, the governor hoping to tackle with $6 million in scholarships. Mandatory overtime can only continue for so long. And with the shortage like it is, we have got to have people who are willing to step into those shoes and continue that fight. This helps get nurses into the profession. We also have to keep our existing nurses. And to do that, the governor also wants to create a five-year loan forgiveness program. Someone becomes a nurse or nursing faculty and stays in that job for five years, they could get up to $15,000 of loan forgiveness through this state program. Health departments and nursing homes would also receive a boost with the workers in each of these fields receiving hero pay bonuses and also a major investment in mental health. 988. So from now on, anybody who needs help, all they'd have to do is dial 988. Bashir signing the state on to a new crisis support line, replacing the suicide hotline in July and creating 170 new jobs for Kentucky's mental health centers. Think about those two in combination and having an easy to call three digit line where more people are calling to get help and then more people on the ground ready 24 seven to be there here in Kentucky. In Frankfurt, Bodie Brooks, Fox 56 News. The governor's proposal also invests in support services in areas such as child abuse, senior hunger, and veteran homelessness.